When Grandma Gives You a Lemon Tree, written by Jamie L. B. Denham and illustrated by Lorraine Rocha. You were hoping for one of these. Birthday wish list. One, robot dog. Two, drone. Three, computer. Four, phone. Five, remote control car. Six, headphones. But surprise! It's a lemon tree? What should you do when grandma gives you a lemon tree for your birthday? First of all, act excited. Your face should look like this. Not this. And definitely not this. Next, say something polite. Try, thank you, just what I needed? Keep smiling until grandma leaves or falls asleep and do not harm your lemon tree. Don't drop it off a bridge. Tie it to your birthday balloons. Play ding dong ditch the lemon tree. Now listen closely, this is important. Place your lemon tree in a sunny spot. Be careful not to overwater and prepare for battle against intruders. When winter arrives, keep your lemon tree warm, then wait, and wait, and wait some more. Once the snow melts, it's time to bring your lemon tree back outside. Well done. Sure, you can decorate your lemon tree, or hide behind it. Come out, come out wherever you are. But you know what's even more fun? Picking lemons! Woohoo! Pick them, slice them, squeeze them. Come on, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze a roux. Ta da! Now you have lemon juice. You didn't think I'd just leave you with lemon juice, did you? Of course not. Remember those gifts you were hoping for? It's good you're staying focused. Gather these items. One, lemon juice. Two, water. Three, a pinch or handful of sugar. Four, flashy lemonade stand. Cue a dazzling smile and... Cutching. Count your cash and head to the store. Now you can finally buy exactly what you want. Something you can really enjoy and share with others too.